a car starts from a point p at time t is equal to 0 seconds and stops at point q if the distance x covered by it in t seconds is given by x is equal to t square of t 2 minus t upon 3 so a car is moving from a point p to q at t is equal to 0 seconds means rest position and at point q it stops then the distance traveled by it and the distance is given x is equal to t square of 2 minus t upon 3 then its velocity is dx by dt which is equal to uh, this is 2t square d by dt of 2t square minus t cube by 3 differentiating with respect to t so we'll be getting 4p minus 3t square upon 3 so which is equal to 4t minus t square and velocity is zero at either in the starting position or stopping stop position so if velocity v is equal to zero that is dx by dt is equal to zero that is 4t minus t square is equal to zero t common 4 minus t is equal to zero at time t is equal to zero seconds and t is equal to four seconds we can see that it stops t is equal to 0 it's not at all moving means it's a starting position and t is equal to 4 we can consider its end position so for time t is equal to 4 the distance traveled is for t is equal to for time 4 seconds distance traveled x is equal to t square that is 4 square of 2 minus t upon 3 that is 4 minus 4 upon 3 which is equal to 16 times of 2 upon 3 that is 32 upon 3 So here given statement 1 the time taken by car to reach Q is 4 seconds so which is true statement 1 is true and distance traveled from P to Q is 32 meters but here we got 32 upon 3 meters so which is not correct so the statement 2 is false so we can say statement 1 is true first option.